Hello everyone. Innovantex welcomes you on the platform TBT task based training. This is another support video for task 3. On the screen, you can observe a basic circuit which comprises Arduino Uno and breadboard. Now it's time to add another component which is DC gear motor. So search H O B B Y hobby in your search panel. You can see a component name hobby gear motor will be available. So simply drag and drop to our tinkering area. By dragging it you can see that this motor is having two terminals one is positive and another is negative. By giving power supply to this motor the axis which are of white color will be rotating at as per given code. So now it's time to connect our motor to our Arduino Uno. Connect this terminal which is positive to any of the digital pin which is given in the Arduino board. So I am connecting it to the digital pin 2. Let's color this wiring connection to red for simplicity. After connecting this we have to connect our negative terminal over here. So connect this negative terminal to the ground of the breadboard and just color simply it black. Now our connection with Arduino and gear motor is almost done. Understanding this connection we are giving power supply from this digital pin D2 to the output device which is gear motor. Now it's time to code this. As we are done with the connections we are looking forward for the code. So here as motor is an output device we have to select the block from output which is set pin. So simply drag and drop to our coding part. As I have connected my motor to the digital pin D2 I am selecting 2 over here and initially my motor is high which is on. It will start rotating. For how much time I have to rotate that motor we have to select the block from control which is weight block. So simply drag and drop the weight block below the previously dragged block. I have given the delay of 5 seconds. After 5 seconds I want my motor to stop at its position. So right click on that, duplicate it and paste it below the blocks. Now make this high option to low. It's time to observe our code and our circuit. So click on start simulation. You can see over here that my motor is started rotating and at 5 seconds it stopped. You can also observe the RPM which are given on the motor. For first 5 seconds it will rotate, after 5 seconds it will stop and this cycle will rotate until we didn't click on this stop simulation. Right now due to less power supply our motor is rotating at max 51 and minimum at 0 RPM. So this is all about the support video for DC gear motor. Thank you.